Well, what is going on YouTube world? Gavin Peacock here. And what I wanted to share with you guys today is not my custom Flip Society coffee mug. Thank you, Doug Outdoors. It is what is sticking to the side of my custom mug. Now there's a company called XClear. They're known for their hydrophobic lens or film protectors to get rid of all water drops on lenses, on action cameras. No licking, mud off the screen anymore, hallelujah. But they've sent me their newest product called the, well they're calling it the Nano Suction Mound. Nano meaning billions. They claim millions of microscopic suction cups on this little plastic card on both sides. It's creating vacuums on a microscopic surface um, that basically is so small you can't get dirt into there so therefore you never lose a stick. This kind of looks like a sticker but when I put my hand on it, there's no stick at all. Although when you stick it to any smooth surface, that sucker hangs on pretty darn good and we're gonna do some tests. And just to show you guys a little physical demo on how strong this bugger holds, the nano suction cups. 2.5 pound weight plate with a bunch of Sits up on this guy, no problem. Can keep my hand in just in case. And it takes a lot of force in terms of shear strength to get that suction cup to break. Let's just use GoPros. Five and six have the screen on the back, so that's a smooth enough surface that this guy can just stick to the back. They send you this little plastic film that you cut out to put on any other camera, so I got the four here today. We're gonna stick this guy on, and then I'm going to start sticking the back surface to anything I can find. I am prying with my life right now. Holy To get this off, oh, wow. So with their term nano suction cup, unlike this, oh, I can't really see it, the soap dispenser, sticky glued to the mirror. This is a 100% continuable, renewable suction stick. It'll never lose its sticking power. Um, if it gets dirty, this one finger lick clears the film off and you can physically watch it dry. Uh, so it's blistering quick and then you can just stick it onto whatever else you want. So let's go find out what we can stick this to. Let's get the easy surfaces out of the way. Sticking. Open up. Close. Make some pretty creative angles. Got clean tile. Stick. Boom. No problem. Clean tile check. Here we are in the shower. Wanna get freaky in the shower? Boom. Hey, use your GoPro any way you want to. It's your life. Okay, GoPro on a mirror. Boom, look how easy that is. Floating in space. Get your selfies, get your muscle shots. What you ever gotta do for the Instagram. Easy. And this actually takes some force to get off of there too. That's sticking no problem. Open and closing. Taking off of there. That was paint. This is vinyl. Vinyl should be no problem. Nice smooth surface. Opening. So I get you some pretty creative shots. Here's a painted drywall. You can, you can see the porous pattern on it, and I can just I can feel that there's no attachment there. I also wanted to get brave and do this rough plywood, but there is no attachment there. But now I'm seeing that's picking up a lot of crap, so I'm gonna give this a lick and clean it off, let it dry, and then we'll try this again. I can put it on there, it's holding. It definitely doesn't have as much bite as glass would, but definitely grips a lot of different surfaces. Right here we got lockers, right there on the locker, test the grip, good. And then you can get some pretty cool creative shots. Boom, boom. Or inside, look how quick this setup is. Boom, click to the back. GoPro is recording, close, open, close, open. No problem. Right here we got a vinyl banner. Vinyl banner. Push the stick. Look at that, it's holding. It's holding, vinyl banner. It works smooth enough. I think this one's really cool. It's obviously going to stick to the monitor, but if you're ever doing any of your tutorial videos and you want a, a camera back, you normally have to mount something off to the side. For this guy, just plunk it, boom, dead center on your monitor. Now you got that camera looking right back at you. You can be clickety clacketing, talking about whatever you're doing, talking into the camera, 
Easy peasy. Doesn't get in the way. Doesn't obstruct you. This thing's awesome so far. Okay, here we are out in the car. You're driving along, you like to do your little rant videos with your camera or phone. Normally your phone's propped up on the windshield, the GoPro's dancing all over the place. Uh, with nano suction, click, there I am. Making a movie, talking, 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 talking. You can do sides. This camera could get the person beside you, but I wanna do that. Plopper right on the rear view mirror, like so. And I can still see while I'm driving. I can talk while I'm driving. All is well. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. All right, back home. It wasn't as cool as I thought outside, so I tossed the GoPro in the freezer with the nano section on the back. I was trying to think of the downfalls of this mount, and I was thinking if it got too cold, maybe the millions of suction cups will stop working. So I'm going to pop her out and stick it to the fridge. I know it lasted on here all night in regular room temperature. So let's grab it out of the freezer and stick it on. Look at that, moving the whole fridge with its suction still. So that's pretty darn good, pretty darn good. Dang. It's gonna be very inexpensive in terms of the power that it can do, so why not just have one in your repertoire for when you need it. That's pretty awesome. Check out the kit starter. I hope these guys launch this for sure. And also check out the hydrophobic uh, films they create. Anyway, that's it for now, guys. Like this video, subscribe. More content and reviews coming your way. See ya.